Okay, I'd like to do a uh, video about a song that's in my head uh, from The Doors. It's not from this album. It's actually from the only Doors album I don't own, okay? I want to do a video about the peace sign, okay? I want to do a complete video about the peace sign where I'm not rushed, trying to cram in as much information as I possibly can about all these different hand signs into a 15-minute video. So, why do I have the When You're Strange? Well, that's because I enjoy it, okay? I think I'm pretty strange, and I'm pretty sure there are others out there who are strange as well, and, you know, this is going out to all of you, okay? Okay? A film by Tom DeKillo, When You're Strange, okay? Narrated by Johnny Depp. It's a film about the doors, guys, because they were strange. In fact, they weren't just strange, guys. I'm pretty sure... Mason, 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 Mason. Okay, guys? Because their producer, you watch this movie, you know, they produced, I think, the first three or four albums. Don't quote me on that. With David Rockefeller in New York City. So, if anyone knows about the secret knowledge, guys, it's the Rockefellers, okay? And the Rothschilds, okay? So, David Rockefeller used this band, who had talent... To indoctrinate the masses, most likely, okay? Who knows if they, if, like, you know, all credit, writing credits went to the doors and this and that. It could just been, like, like a little agreement behind stage. Maybe Jim Morrison knew a little bit more about secret knowledge but than the others. But that's not true because uh, this guy here, what's his name? I know his name. Uh, Ro uh, John Des uh, Ronnie, Robbie Krieger, yeah. Robbie Krieger here. He helped write the songs too. Okay, and John Desmore, listen to this guy speak. Okay? Listen to him speak. If if ever in my in the wildest dreams of my imagination, I closed my eyes and imagined what a Freemason would sound like, it would be Ray Manzarek. Okay? Jim Morrison, he just knows better, okay? He knows he's an infinite soul. Okay, he knows there's no death. Okay? Jim Morrison's just gonna see what happens, okay? Me and Jim would get along fairly well, I'd imagine. Ray Manzarek, okay? Like, I don't know, man. <laughs> Scripted, polished, refined. Robbie Krieger, you know? John Desmore. John Desmore, in the, it, he kind of seems like he was pretty uptight as well. You know, maybe like he was uneasy with the whole thing that he knows that they're deceiving the masses with their, you know propaganda like you know i don't want to call it satanic or propaganda or whatever but they're they're hiding the truth they know things that you don't they don't want to share it with you because that's how they get famous and that what that's what pays for their life that's what gives them the money they need to be comfortable in life okay those guys so you know you don't piss in the pool you're swimming in guys okay that's pretty, that's just self-preservation. I hold nothing against any of these guys. I hold nothing against any one of them. They made billions or millions of people really happy with their music and entertained. And that's a good thing. But, uh, yeah, people are strange, guys, you know? Okay? People are strange when you're a stranger. Faces look ugly when you're alone. Women seem wicked when you're unwanted. Streets are uneven when you're down. Anyways, I can relate with three of four of five of these lines. You guys get that? Three of four of five. Okay. All right, so let's get on to uh, the peace sign, okay? So, so the song... I, let, let's get into why I'm even talking, okay? I'm talking because I have a song trapped in my head and I won't get out. And that song is... Five to one, baby, one and five. No one here gets out alive. Five to one. You yeah. know, one and five. Anyways, that's what got me here. That's what got me going. That's what made me look at look at the peace symbol, you know, slower. Okay, I can go all day and decode this. Hey, look, guys. Five to one is the eleventh song. I'm surprised, actually. No, I'm not. Okay, 
I don't give a shit, guys. I'm trying to I'm trying to be a little upbeat about life, you know? Anyways, so these are the songs, guys. Okay, Hello, I Love You. I'm sure, like, you can decode. Look, Celebration of the Lizard. You know, the reptilians, guys? David Rockefeller? Not to touch the earth? What the hell does that mean? Okay. Summer's Almost Gone. Wintertime Love. The Unknown Soldier. Spanish Caravan. My Wild Love. We could be so good together. Yes, the river knows. I don't know. The river Euphrates. Okay. Armageddon, guys. Revelation 16. 5 to 1! 5 to 1, baby! 1 in 5! Okay, so here we go. This is, I think, the complete rendition of what the hell's going on in my brain. Okay? Look at the fingers that are up. They are depicting a V. Okay? These are going off infinitely, but they have a circle that they're connected to, a singularity, which is called the hand. That's why I depicted it like this. Now, if you do zero dimensional singularities before two one dimensional lines, you get a 21, but you gotta read it from left to right, so it makes a 12. Okay, there's no circle, there's no circle around it because look, I already used a circle. Okay? So 12. And a 12 is equal to a 3. Okay? Now look, you're using the fourth and third digit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We all know that. I'm getting tired of that probably. So 4 and 3 in a circle, because I haven't depicted the circle here. I, have to, I haven't depicted the circle. I have to put a circle around it. So 4 and 3 is equal to 7 with a circle, which take away the circle is an 8. And then you got your 3 and your 8, which is your 11. Okay? Your 11 is your 11. That's surprising. Now look, you have your 4 and 3, Let's not talk about circles. Your 4 and 3 actually make an 11, okay? Four and your 4th digit and your 3rd midget digit actually... I saw the midget on the cover. Your 4th digit and your 3rd digit actually make an 11. So your 4 and your 3 make a 1-1. One, one. So it's a 7 and a 2, which is your 9, which is your 9-11. I hope that's clear to everyone. I hope that's complete. Now let's look at the down stuff. 5-2-1! We'll stop. With a circle around it. Nine. I don't think I have to go into detail there. And look, you got a one, a one, a one, and a one. Okay? So you got four ones. You know, making a one, 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 one. Nine, eleven, nine, eleven. Okay? Now, get this, okay? So your your bent finger, when you do the peace sign, look, the you're hiding all this section of your finger. Okay? You don't see that. But when you bend your thumb, you have you see that section. Okay? You don't see that section. You see that section. Okay? So the bend fingers hide the middle, the hide the bendy, or the bend, <laughs> and the thumb cannot. So that's important when we go to the next dimension. Okay? So 911, 911, that's what this means over here. But look, it's also making a zero, because we know this is attached to the one, so it's a zero going infinitely. A, a zero dimensional dot and a one dimensional line going infinitely. And then this one is different because it's probably touching something and it's connected here and does this, if it has a dot here and a dot here and that's a segment, you're gonna have to complete the V guys. Okay, now check it out. We have five dots and four lines. Five zero dimensional singularities, four one dimensional lines is nine, making two ones guys, nine eleven, nine eleven. Nine eleven. 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 9 it's a self, a self, a self, a self, a self, in a galaxy, in a galaxy, in a universe. Which is equal to 7 in a, in a galaxy, 8 in a galaxy, in a universe. Get rid of the galaxies, you have an 8 and a 9 in a universe. Or a 17 in a universe. Or an 18 when you get rid of the universe. Or a 9. Isn't that interesting? A 9. And then look at this. The universe, if you look at it differently has two dots in it. 
One, one, eleven, nine, eleven. Still don't believe me, guys? Look. Remember, you're making a peace sign, which is a V. These fingers are making this, and this finger is making this. The thumb is making that. So what do I see in the universe and galaxy and selves, okay? I see a universe with two zeroth dimensional singularities. Furthermore, okay, dot and line, dot and line, uh, Kevin, 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 I guess, oh yeah, now I remember, <sighs> now I remember, sorry guys, left hand of God, right hand of God. Okay? On the left hand, you have three zeroth dimensional singularities. On the right hand, you have two zeroth dimensional singularities. Okay? Because they would make lines going up, guys. I, like, this is the paper with the pen on the paper, but look. We're talking about one, two, three going up, one, two going up, one, two, three going up, one, two going up. And your universe has two galaxies, okay? Your universe has two galaxies. 9-11, like 9-11 of the universe, 9-11 of the universe, and 9-11, 9-11 of the galaxies, okay? I hope that was complete enough. I hope that was entertaining enough. <laughs> I'll stop singing, guys. Cheers.